today is Thursday, January 15, 2015. I'm Dave Landry, and it's the market of Bitsco. Well, if he's on a fairly hard, he'll lose about a percent of the value. This actually has approached in their recent little lows in here, which is right around the area of their 200-day moving average. Very important for these levels to hold. NASDAQ also had support in here, approaching the prior lows. As you can see, losing about a percent and a half of its value. Ideally, you want to see it stabilize in here, too. Let's take a look at the rest of the all the way down. It's 200-day moving average. As you can see, it's been flat for quite some time in here. Ideally, you want to see that support Hold two. On the upside, gold looks like the bottom is still in place there. So continue to look to position in the gold stocks. Unfortunately, a lot of areas looking kind of ugly in here. Back to chart way out, like I've been saying quite a bit in the banks. They've got a long ways to go if they continue to break down in here. Some of these other areas like retail, which have been doing fairly well, losing a little steam at high levels. You know the routine, though. Take things one day at a time. For now, though, you might just want to sit on your hands and let things shake out a little bit. Any questions, as usual, Dave at DaveLander.com. I'm Dave Landry, and you start the market in a minute.